I'm sorry, Victor, I know you don't understand, but I have to do this. I respect your decision, Ash, that you want to not hurt people, but we are werewolves. There's no way around it. I understand that we're werewolves. I can live with that. I just can't live with killing innocent people. A werewolf with a conscience is a vulnerable werewolf. Remember that. Trust me, I do remember that. You are a natural-born killer, Ash. I will miss you out there tonight. I won't. Welcome, gentlemen, to Victor's Club. Enjoy yourselves tonight. Yeah, well, all I'm saying is he's not with the pack if he won't go out and enjoy the night with us. Sorry, Connor, but I respect his decision. It's his life. He can do what he wants with it. Yeah, well, he's in danger in the pack. What if we run into anything? Any kind of trouble like the hunters? We need him for backup. Come on, I got no doubt he's got our back, but he doesn't want to kill innocent people. I understand that. This referee must be blind or stupid. Do you not see what is happening in front of you? Whoa, Troy, take it down a notch, okay? It's just a game. Please, Lucas, to you, this is just a game. To us, it is a life. Okay, damn, sorry, I get it. You guys are way into soccer. Soccer, this is not soccer. You will never understand. Just like I don't understand why Ash is locking himself away. Come on, Troy, I totally get why he's locking himself away. He's killed a lot of people over the centuries. I would too. What fresh meat do you have for me tonight, Doctor? Well, oh, good evening, Victor. I have plenty of meat to choose from. Fresh bodies just came in. Very good, my pack will be glad to hear that. Have you heard any news about the hunters? Well, I can tell you they haven't been by here yet, but you know I would never rat you out. Of course I know that, Doctor. You are deranged and insane like the rest of us. Oh, now, Victor, flattery will get you everywhere. I just have to stay out of trouble. Who is that? I have definitely never seen you before. Gotta find out who he is. I'm gonna get to my appointment with Dr. Wu. Gonna be late. Damn it, he's leaving. I should follow him. No, that would be too creepy. I have to figure out a way to convince my father to let me stay here. To let the entire clan stay here. It's not going to be easy, though. All I'm saying is that we cannot be reckless. The hunters are all over us, and they will find us. Yeah, well, you know whose fault that is. It's not ours. It's Victor's clan. They're reckless. Yes, well, you know we can never tell them that. We have to stick together. We are all one family. Come on, Jeremiah. Are we really a family? Are we... Do we even work together? Listen to me, Rick. You are young. You have to understand. Nobody crosses Victor. Yeah, okay. I get it. Okay, yeah, I'm sorry, but that makes absolutely no sense. And I don't agree with it. Come on now, Danny. I mean, Ash is a born killer. He can't just lock himself away. Not forever. Yeah, well, he's just going through some stuff. He needs to sort it out on his own. We need to stay out of it and respect it. Hey, I got no problem with respecting it, but Victor's not going to stand for it for long. Yeah, well, that's going to be between him and Victor, and we need to stay out of it. So let's get this place cleaned up. Come on, Zach. You and I belong together, and you know it. There's no way you're going to get away from me. Katie, you're a beautiful woman. And I am interested. But I know your history. Corner nuts. Oh, come on now, Zach. All of us have that killer instinct. Mine just came out more when I turned. Actually, I really don't have that killer instinct. I've barely killed anybody in the hundred years I've been a werewolf. Oh, well, don't you worry about that, Jack. I'll teach you. Gee, actually, that's what I'm afraid of. Don't have to concern yourself about the hunters. They will be dealt with. Victor is not just the hunters. Katie is a problem, too. She's the one that brought them to our door. It's what I warned you that bringing a woman into the park would be very, very dangerous. They are unstable. Oh, believe me, I know that she is unstable. But she is also cunning and smart. Yes, well, that is a very dangerous combination. Now, let us get to other business about Ash. I take it he is still locking himself away? Yes, and I don't like it. Okay, we should totally report back to Victor. We found out where the hunters are meeting. We can come back here and destroy them once and for all. Boy, you really are into this tearing people apart thing, aren't you? Take it down a little bit. No, I will not take it down a little bit, Lucas. We are killers. We are born to do this. The others are weak. Oh, I don't know about that. The hunters are pretty strong. They're more than just human. Yes, they may have angel blood, but they can still be killed. I will enjoy it. 
Well now, Jeremiah, what brings you over here? Come on now, Dr. Strollen, you know why I am here. You need to hide those bodies that Katie delivered. Oh, come now, if that's all you're worried about, they've already been disposed of, no problem. I am sorry, doctor, but there is a problem. The police have been sniffing around my offices. They know something is up. Yes, I got a similar phone call from an Inspector Blake. He'll be by. I'll take care of it, don't worry. You cannot tell me not to worry, doctor. Katie is always going to be a problem. Yeah, well, I just wanted to give you the heads up. Victor's really pissed about you doing this cage thing. Yeah, thanks for that, Lucas, but me and Victor, we're never going to see eye to eye, and I can't kill anymore. Yeah, well, I feel it's fair to warn you that he's not the only one that's pissed. The packs have been talking about you. Yeah, well, they just better understand that this is my business, my choice, not theirs. Yeah, I totally respect that, but you are still part of a pack. And if we need you, you gotta know you have our back. Trust me, Lucas, if it's important, you guys will always have my back. Oh, there are police officers sniffing around. Keep your eyes open, Troy. Oh, of course you know I will, Victor. But I believe that the hunters are the police. But perhaps these hunters are not as dumb as I thought they were. They have upped their ranks. Yes, Victor, I believe that we need another pack meeting. And we need Ash to be on board. Troy, never tell an alpha how to run the pack. You do not worry about Ash. He is my problem, not yours. Of course, Victor, forgive me. I spoke out of turn. Just do as you're told. Yeah, well, the cops are getting a little too close for comfort. We need to make sure we're all on the same page. Okay, well, I don't know if we're all on the same page, but we're in the same pack. So we gotta watch each other's back. Yeah, well, I still think that Ash is betraying us by locking himself up. We need him. Come on now, Connor, I think we got Ash. He'll do what we want when we need him. Yeah, well, to me, it sounds like he wants his independence. How long before he does leave the pack? Come on now, Connor. He's not gonna leave. Besides, Victor would never let him. Yeah, well, I don't think it's safe for any of us to go out hunting tonight. Please, Danny, it was never gonna be safe for any of us to go out at night. But we have to. That's what we do. Yeah, well, these hunters are getting way too smart these days. It's not like back in the Dark Ages, you know. Yeah, well, I blame it all on the technology. Besides, Victor's not gonna let us not go on a hunt. Not with Ash being out of the game. Yeah, well, I'm starting to think maybe Ash has got the right idea. And we should all stay on the down low. Shit, Danny, don't let Victor hear you say that, or you'll be in trouble. Look, Jack, Katie used to be a good person when I first met her. Maybe you can help her. And I knew Jeremiah. I think she's beyond help. I mean, she really scares me. She's got a dark side. Yeah, well, unfortunately, I think that's the wolf inside of her that makes her that way. But if she's got love, I think she'll be okay. I really hope you're right, because I think I might be falling for her. You know, it might be crazy. Hey, come on now, Jack. Love is never crazy. It's, it's what it is. Hope you're right. Well, hello, gorgeous. What brings you here today? Oh, come on now, Marvin. I was just checking in on you, making sure everything was okay. Yeah, well, you don't have to worry. I took care of those bodies. No problemo. Oh, trust me, I was never worried. You're just as crazy as I am. You know how to cover your tracks. Yes, indeed I do. So how are things going with Zack? Got him in your bed yet? Well, aren't you nosy? Not yet, but I will. He's totally mine. I yeah, wish I could find someone. All right, gentlemen, this meeting will come to order. Hang on a minute, eh? Are we missing somebody, Victor? Yeah, you're where's Ash anyway? Probably busy locking himself up again. You don't have to worry where Ash is. You already called me that he was going to be late. So what's going on, Victor? You sound really upset. It's trouble, isn't it? Yes, gentlemen, I am afraid that it is trouble. The hunters are coming. And I think they may have help from the witches and possibly angels. So it's not going to be safe to do our hunt tonight. Oh my god, what have I done? I promised I would never kill anyone. I smell blood. Where is it? Whoa, it's you. This is not exactly how I wanted to meet. Wait, I've seen you on campus. You're a werewolf. I am sorry that we had to meet like this. But you're a vampire. Yes, I am a vampire. So this... Could never work. I have to go. Please, Max, don't go. I need your help. Someone left my cage open on purpose. Well, wait a minute, I'm sorry you helped a werewolf? I'm confused. Yeah, I have been joined the club. I don't understand. But I knew I had to help him. Like he didn't mean to kill anyone. Yeah, well, I'll leave it to you, the only vampire who doesn't want to kill anyone, to find a werewolf who doesn't want to kill anyone. Damn, this would make a great book. Heaven, I'm sorry, you know I compelled you. You can't tell anyone. Yes, of course, I know that. So what are you going to do now? Honestly, I have no idea. I was hoping that you could help me with this. 
Damn, a mere mortal.